It is a great blessing and big news for COVID patients all over the world. The anti-COVID drug 2-deoxy-D glucose or 2-DG in short developed by India's DRDO may be available in market from next week. The new drug is expected to bring great relief to thousands of people struggling to breathe in COVID hospitals and those receiving home treatment. This is because the powdered 2-DG drug can be dissolved in water and consumed easily. The compounds in the drug will invade the infected cells and destroy the viruses. The medicine will detect the virus infected cells and attack them. Thus, it is effective in treating patients with severe or moderate infection. The advantages of the medicine are it will bring quick relief to patients having breathing difficulty. Hospital stay will be reduced. Oxygen demand will decrease. And the medicine will also destroy genetically mutated viruses. Amazingly, on the third day, 42% of the patient who were given the drug did not need oxygen. India's development of the drug for COVID treatment after Covaxin has in fact become a major achievement globally. The DRDO or the Defense Research and Development Organization is an agency under the Department of Defense Research and Development in the Ministry of Defense of the Government of India. Assigned with the military's research and development, it is headquartered in Delhi. DRDO Chief G. Sadish Reddy on Sunday said the anti-COVID drug which has been approved for emergency use will be launched by May 11th or 12th. Explaining further, the DRDO chief said the drug will help neutralize most of the COVID-19 symptoms and will prevent the growth of the virus inside the body. Regarding the availability of the drug, Reddy said arrangements for proper distribution across all hospitals need to be done and a team is already working on the same. Speaking about the drug, the DRDO chief also said it would help improve the level of oxygen in the body. The drug is expected to help coronavirus patients within three days of consumption. An anti-COVID-19 therapeutic application of the 2DG has been developed by the Institute of Nuclear Medicine and Allied Sciences, INMAS, a lab of DRDO in collaboration with Dr. Reddy's laboratories in Hyderabad. A higher portion of patients treated with 2DG showed RT-PCR negative conversion in COVID patients. The drug has been approved by the Drugs Controller General of India for emergency use as an adjunct therapy in moderate to severe coronavirus patients. It is most effective when 2DG is given in addition to the treatment prescribed by the ICMR. Thousand sachets of 2DG are expected to be released on May 11th or 12th for emergency use in Hyderabad, G. Sadish Reddy said. Two weeks later, when 2DG becomes available in significant quantities, there will be a large-scale production, he said. The 2DG accumulates in virus-infected cells, stopping viral synthesis and energy production and inhibiting virus growth. The fact that it accumulates in the infected cells makes this drug stand out, Dr. Reddy said. News Desk, Kaumati English. Thank you.